What is it? In a Aramaic language, Ilahi, Ilahi, lima sabaktani. My God, my God, why do forsaken me? Why you leave me alone? Or in Tagalog, Diyos ko, Diyos ko, bakit mo ako pinabayan? And that's the biggest proof, according to the Bible, that it is not Jesus. Because we respect Him, we love Him. He cannot say these words. He cannot say these words to God. And that Jesus cannot complain. And if they respect and love Jesus, you should not, they should not accuse Jesus of this kind of bad words. Blasphemous words. Complaining words to God. If you are in crisis, you are very poor, you have no eat, food to eat, and you start to complain God, that why, why you give us this kind of life? Why no food and like this? So you become a kafir, correct? Because you are complaining your God. You become a kafir, you become a disbeliever. You are complaining to the Creator. While He is put you in trial, and if you fail in your trial because you are complaining, but if you are make sabar to your trial, then Allah will take away from you from the trial, and He will give you the better life. Because whenever the trial comes, the true believers, they never speak the bad words like that. Because these are the words of either no faith or either very weak faith. The person is saying, Ilahi ilahi lima sabaktani. Jusko jusko bakit ako mo pinabayan? Bakit mo ko pinabayan? Jusko jusko bakit pinabayan mo ko? My God, my God, why do forsaken me? Why you leave me alone? Why you not helping me? You cannot say why to God. You cannot say why to Allah. Why? Once you say why to Allah, you are disbelieving Allah. You don't respect Allah anymore. Hindi pwede sabihin, bakit? Sa Allah, hindi pwede yan. Kung kayo na maniniwala, hindi pwede sabihin ng bakit sa Allah. Because once you say bakit, you are already questioning Allah. Kung sinabi mo, bakit ginawa mo ako, ganun, you are complaining already. You can do it to others, but not to Allah. 